They're your favourite auctions, you say, the one bit of auctions. Well, I find that, you know, if you were to say that to a seller, they'd be like, no, I don't want a one bitter auction because every seller naturally wants 10 bitter. But I think what I love about a one bitter auction is the intimacy of it and the work and the skill that goes into getting a deal across the line with one bidder. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like yeah. it's more intimate, but the conversation between that one bidder mm. and the seller, you know what it's like. You, yeah. you actually hear all of that conversation behind the scenes. Yeah. And I feel like when you've got, it's all well and good to have a competitive auction where it's like bang, 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 you know, and, and then it's sold. That's great. They're the best ones, you know, in terms of a result of the seller. But I never discount the one bidder auction because it's really no different to just having a negotiation with one buyer after the auction, right? Yeah. But you're doing it in that public environment, you're doing it in a shortened time frame, there's a little bit of urgency in that yeah. moment. And I feel like it's more work, and personally I feel like it's more rewarding because you put more work into it. Yeah, it is. Like we had one for Andy the other, what, a week and a half ago. The auction started at five, there was two bidders, but it ended up coming down to one in particular. Uh, we finished up at 6.30, that's how long the negotiations yeah. and I just felt like that was one of the most rewarding auctions we've had for a long time. I think even like sitting in the room and it's like Tatha auction, like you would come in and you'd go out and then you'd come back with like five grand more and we were all like, Whoa! Yeah. and then you'd leave again and you'd do it again and they're like, Billy's the best and I'm like, oh, I even get caught up in the moment, I'm like, he's awesome. <laughs> like that's it's so exciting. Part. Yeah. That's the fun part. Otherwise, you know, with a really competitive auction, you're really just calculating yeah. as an auctioneer or yeah. even as an agent. Sometimes as an agent, if you, and again, credit to the agent who has generated three, four, five registered, registered bidders and all of that in that competition environment, which is really cool. But sometimes the agents don't have to do anything yeah. and the auctioneer does everything. Yeah. You know? So it's sort of, I love working hard. I love working hard in a negotiation. And I love when the sellers see you working hard. Yeah. I love when the sellers are clearly um, they're very clear that the agent's exhausted yeah. the market. Yeah. That's my, my favourite part.